this is part two of the last um pick a pal for the tarot so let's go ahead and get these messages out this is ending up for the second pal so let's go can we clarify the king of swords please So the King of Swords is in a moody, uh, in a moody energy right now. Somebody, because something is not going right for this person. This person may be sensitive right now. This person may be crying a lot right now. This person may be very emotional right now. There's a Queen of Swords that's in this energy too. Somebody got with a Queen of Swords to fill the void in, only to be disappointed. And that's why you're masculine going through this energy. He thought this person was the star. Only to find out that she delivered um, bad karma to him. She was a uh, she was sly as hell had she gotten this masculine's energy. She's uh she was in this six of wands energy in the reverse. This person would not be successful. This person possibly got a um a platform of some sort. Maybe she was looked up to the community at one time, but she's not leading people the right way. She's deceiving people. She will not be successful. She's going to have a success block, or she could be have, going through a success block. She's an arrogant winner. This person is only seeking praise and fame. Yes. Someone will be in sneaking and conniving, trying to get your person to leave you and somebody else confirmation she did that by being manipulative so your person left you and somebody else to be with her she was trying to one up you behind your back yeah he left you to be to enter a, a partnership a business ship with someone who was not fruitful somebody who was uh calculated <laughs> in the things that they do this is a person who need to improve a skill who very weak and lopsided Somebody didn't even put the work in with a business. So he signed a contract with somebody who was very lackluster is what I'm picking up. It's time for this situation to bring. It's time for this situation to close out. So it says close this situation out. Whoever I'm talking to, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Because you got with somebody that's too bossy with the King of Wands energy. Somebody who's too aggressive, too bossy, too uh, overpowering. Somebody who wants to uh, rule you. Collective. I feel like I'm talking to a masculine. But I feel like that you are still, there's a masculine that's too weak. I feel like they can't move. They can't meditate because you got this demonic energy in your a cycle. If you can't meditate, you can't pray, you can't connect to your guides. It's because you got this demonic energy that's in your um, energy and it's stopping you from healing. Guys, you have to cut people off. You got to let the money go so you can heal. It is what it is. Yeah. Somebody has not seen the bigger picture here. It's unclear. Uh, somebody got poor um, communication. No, no good. They don't have good ideas. The truth. They have. They lied about this situation. They lied about who they really are, just to get your masculine. That's crazy. And masculine, you stayed and you believed in all the lies that this person gave you, and it put and it got you stuck in the situation. She possibly told you that she was going to gain some type of, y'all was going to make this money together only for you to get played. So she, she was going to sit on her ass and you give her the money. She was going to give you, the, uh, you was going to give her the money. You doing all this work and she wasn't going to do shit, but just suck you dry. The only reason that she was wanting to be with you is because she was wanting your money. And you now you, I feel like you seeing that now, or you realizing it and you just feel like you two weak and can't move, or you still need some type of assistance from her. That's one way to look at it. So let's go with the Knight, the Knight of Pentacles in reverse. Who is this Knight of Pentacles in reverse? Somebody you had a family with. Four of Wands. Yeah, this Empress. What I tell y'all, she was in this. She was this. She's this uh, King of Pentacles in a reverse energy. So not only she don't give back to the community or give back to you. She don't give it back. She don't give back to her own family. She is not connected with the Most High. She's weak, very materialistic. She um has. She's very infertile. She does not grow anything. She's disconnected from nature. She cannot even tap in with nature, not the elements of nature, not the universal nature, not, not anything like that. She's very weak-minded, weak instinct, and would do anything to tap some uh, to trap somebody into a marriage. And she she used money to tap you to trap you into a marriage, man. Yeah, you tired of being juggled by this woman? 
She could possibly have blonde hair. But our heart cold as fuck, though. Yeah, you offered you offered her a, um, a commitment of some sort. You offer her some type of help. This person is stuck in their own beliefs. You could have been stuck in your own beliefs. Yeah. You got with a page of wands. You got with a freaking page. You know who a page is? These are child people in your energy. She was a child. She think like a child. Not saying that she was a child, but she think like a child, act like a child. If it think of, speak of, and act of, guess what? They are a child. So you got, you offered a commitment with a child who you thought that was an empress. Come to find out she wasn't an empress. You married this person only for this marriage to fail with the lover's card being in reverse because you thought she had money. Let's move to the next deck. Damn. Damn, baby. So, can you clarify the Page of Cups for me, please? What's going on with this Page of Cups? Somebody um, is not emotionally filled with this um, Page of Cups. Like I said, you're dealing with a childlike behavior here. Someone is an adult that acts like a big-ass child. Somebody who's very emotionally immature. Somebody who do not think before they act. They may have a creative block. They cannot produce anything. They choose not to produce anything. They are very lackluster, childlike, and they have, they are very narcissistic. This is a narcissistic person who's emotionally not tapped into their selves. This person can have emotional dysfunction. They lack creativity and they drain your spirit. They, they drain you spiritually. So they have an energy vampire. Yeah, this page of swords right here. She's popping up everywhere. She's pages, pages, pages. She is so young and so vindictive and so nasty and cunning. That <laughs> I have the Knight of Pentacles in the reverse. I feel like that your person is trying to move because the coin is going the opposite direction. Somebody could be trying to offer you a pinnacle. But it's moving real slow. This situation could be at a standstill. Or I feel like that. No, I feel like somebody's going to offer you. No, somebody was offering the masculine. I feel like somebody was offering a masculine, um, a knight of pinnacle, but they really wasn't into the commitment as they supposed to be. Like they was saying that they was going to, um, be committed to them, that they're going to promise to change, that they was going to get better, um, that they was going to change their ways, but they chose not to. They still, uh, did whatever they did to stop, to not bring this relationship into full fruitation. So I feel like that she could have had somebody else on the side that she was probably giving her time to. And that's what made her take so long with coming together. That's what took her so long to come and offer your masculine something because she was in another commitment relationship with somebody else or she was playing in the streets because she was juggling your masculine already. Yeah, she was being sneaky and deceptive behind your person's back. And your person didn't realize when he offered her this pinnacle, he didn't barely have it all. But he offered her this, this commitment only to get played at the end of the day. Can you clarify this Knight of Pinnacles, please? Yeah, he found out secrets about this person having somebody else. Watch it come out. I know it will. Yeah, secrets was um, revealed here about her juggling him to a Pinnacles. I can't make this up. He found that she had options. Come on, man. Talk to me, spirit. Yes. He was in a family with this person, Ten of Cups. Come on, come on, spirit. She possibly was using a bunch of emotions to get um to get to him. Oh, I miss you. I want to be with you. Please take me back. Please take me back. Being very emotional. Yes. I, and I have the uh, page of Pentacles in reverse. He offered this person this love, and she turned around and shitted on him. She left him financially broke and financially lackluster like had his mind on a, a lower vibrational had his funds on a lower vibrational this person also wasn't experienced 
Like he could have offered her how to uh, to go into business, but she had no creativity to bring this business into fruition because she was copying you or she was copying somebody being fake and phony instead of walking in her own true path. But I see that your masculine could be um, watching their funds, stacking their money, growing their money. Your masculine is manifesting you back in their life is what I'm picking up. Can you clarify the magician? Somebody want to come off you with the Ace of Pentacles now? Because they got backstabbed by this person. So maybe they want to come and... But they may be trying to sneak in conniving on how they come back to you. But I feel like because of everything that happened, that he wants to come back and apologize for everything that pop, that pop, possibly popped off. It wants to... Right the situation, but he's going to be sneaking and deceptive about it because he know that you pissed the fuck off, but he's been hurt and he know that he hurt you. Can you clarify the page, uh, page of Pentacles? I mean, the Ace of Pentacles. This King of Cups right here wants to come in and uh, balance this situation out. Damn, and I just looked down and said balance. He wants to come and balance the situation out. Who the two uh, uh, King of Cups want to balance it out with? He's been holding this onto his chest. That he was with somebody from his past that he's not pleasant with. He didn't basically, possibly didn't want to tell you about this situation. But he he needs healing from somebody he uh, got backs out from anymore. This Knight of Wands, who he seen that was, he thought it was a gift. Well, he, he could see you as a Knight of Wands and you could be his gift. Is that right? Yeah, this King of Wands right here. He was breadcrumbing you with her. She could be, yeah, she's somebody who, look how she keep her legs open. She used witchcraft, whatever, uh, possibly play with herself as she got dang. <laughs> it's the truth, though. I got to tell y'all, that's what they be doing. Playing with herself and stuff. <laughs> Trying to manifest him back. And that's part of black magic, guys, if y'all didn't know. This person was not healed. This person could be a Sagittarian um, energy. And death has been brought to that situation. So we're going to get to the next one. Page of Pentacles. Let me get these cards. Can you clarify the uh, Queen of Pentacles? Somebody was in a relationship with a two, uh, two of Cups. They offered um, some type of pinnacle towards this person with the Queen of Pentacles. Yeah, this karmic energy right here. So that just very, this just even even more let me know that there's another Queen of Pentacles here, or she could be embodying this energy that your person chose to go a new direction and started two of cups with this person after they breadcrumbed you and chose someone over you. They they barely made it. They only uh, picked that person over you because this person had some type of income coming in and they felt like that that situation was more beneficial than you was, and they picked a karmic cycle. This is why they're going through karma now. Yes. They, you are a Stardo Collective, and you stacking your money up. Ooh. Can you clarify the hangman and the reverse, please? The hangman in verse is right here. Confirmation. Uh, somebody is getting a, a, a different perspective of who you are. So somebody is getting a different perspective because there has been a tower moment that is that is associated with a third party energy. Jesus. Yeah. This king of pentacles in reverse, somebody has ha found has got in a new perspective on this person. They now know who this person is. They know that this person juggles them a lot with the Seven of Cups. This person was very immature, uh, Page of Wands energy. This person never finishes projects, always in, uh, oh, I don't have time to do it when they really do. This King of Swords right here had plenty of options on this Emperor right here. She, yeah, she's a, she could be a water sign. Scorpio Pisces cancer and she could be embodying 
the Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, the air signs. She could have slept with your person. She could have slept with somebody that was a water sign. Several people that was water signs. But your person is of power, leadership. So she juggled a fucking emperor. Damn. I got the Ace of Swords in the reverse. He did not want to see the truth of what it was. It's what I'm picking up. And this is why it's leaving him stuck in a lackluster energy. This person is not connecting through prayers and meditation because he's weak right now. He's But he needs to keep praying so he can get past this situation because he was really in love with this person. He could be very moody right now because he, checked, he uh, picked a page of wands. He picked a karmic over a divine feminine, pretty much. Any more messages that I need to get to people? Yeah, he's going through an anxiety right now. She could be going through anxiety right now because a bunch of judgment going on. So I feel like that she's going through anxiety with the nine of pentacles right here in the reverse. I mean, with the nine of pentacles right here. She is uh, possibly going to have, she's possibly somebody that's very mental that needs to go get checked in into an um, a insane asylum because she has lost control of this, of this situation. Can we clarify the nine of swords and we're going to end it? This person is not illuminated. This person can have a son. This person may not be pregnant no more or has lost a son. Your person feel real, real, uh, had feel, had feel real burden about this situation. Because they got backstabbed more than one time by this person. By this page of wands. By the childlike behavior. Now this left your person feeling moody. If you want to know why he hasn't came back around us. Because he's moody right now. This king of swords. Who was dating a nine of pentacles. So that is it. He calls judgment on her. And. He had to walk away just as quick as he got back with her. He was just as quickly dissatisfied because of these secrets that has been foretold. And he thought she was a star. So, guys, that is it. I'll talk to you guys soon. I hope that you enjoyed the poem, the uh, pick a pals, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.